Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will see how to fix Hyper-V Fast Critical Virtual Machine State Error with the status Disk Encountered Critical I/O Errors. So this error occurs when there is an issue with the hard disk. So it can happen in two ways: either the hard disk of the virtual machine is full, or the host machine where this virtual machine is hosted is out of space. So let's check if the virtual machine hard disk space is full. Let's go to settings, go to hard disk drive, and click on inspect. And as you can see, the maximum disk size is 127 GB, and the current file size is 17.28 GB. So let's close this. Let's also cancel this and check the VM state. Let's connect to the VM. As you can see, it is stuck at start and it's not moving further. So let's close this. Let's turn this off and check the host machine disk space. To do that, let's go to start. Let's go to file explorer. As you can see, we only have 4 GB of space on the host machine. Usually, the Hyper-V machines will require a minimum of 10% of disk space to run the Hyper-V virtual machines properly. So let's clear some space on the system and come back once it is done. As you can see, we have cleared some space and we have more than 10% free space. So let's go to Hyper-V manager and try to start the server. And let's connect to the server. As you can see, the server is working fine now, and we have successfully solved the issue, which is related to Hyper-V hard disk I/O error. That's it for this video. Hope to see you on the next one.